Indeed, it is through patience and forbearance and prayer that we will be able to achieve comfort. The soothing of the heart, the contentment of the soul will be achieved through sabr, prayer, that is patience and prayer. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, look, we will test all of you. We will test every single one of you with various tests. Verse number 155, Surah Al-Baqarah. Allah says, we will indeed test you with a bit of fear, with a bit of hunger, with loss of wealth, with loss of life, and with loss in terms of produce. Your business won't do well. You cannot be healthy every day. You have to develop a sickness at some stage for you to turn to Allah, for Allah to test you. You cannot be a person who has a profit every single day. There will be days when you will suffer a loss. You cannot be a person whom every day everything is flowing smoothly. There will be days when things do not flow smoothly. Allah says, give good news to those who bear patience. Who are those who bear patience? He continues to describe them. He says, those whom when calamity strikes them they say we are all belonging to Allah and we will all return to Allah what does this mean this means that you will save yourself from the feeling of sorrow or sadness or the, the feeling within yourself of negativity by relating things to Allah, bearing in mind where you come from and where you are going. I belong to Allah. Allah will cater for me and Allah will take me back when he is ready for me or when the time is fixed, he's going to take me back. He's going to take you back as well. So remember this, we turn to Allah at times of distress as well. And don't only turn to Allah at times of distress, but it should be a turning even at times of ease. Like the hadith says, Get close to Allah. Get close to Allah during days of ease. And you will, you will find Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala come close to you during the difficult days, the days when you are in hardship, Allah will come close to you. So this is something very interesting, my brothers and sisters, Allah will test us, the winner from amongst us, he or she who bears patience and who says, indeed, we belong to Allah and unto Allah is our ultimate return. Anything negative happens, have that dua on your tongues.